I never expected to start a watch. I didn't even expect, you know, it being selected for a festival. So all of that is just an honor. I'm grateful. Hey, this is Richard Harmon. We're here with Woodland at the Worcester Film Festival. I'm the star of the movie. That's right, you're here to hear first. And I think the movie that made me think, I want to do that. I think that's, I think I want to make movies like, like the one I just saw. Uh, and that was Night of the Living Dead. How important is catering on a low budget film? Oh my God, because I'm Italian and I, I love food. Um, it's super important. They said, hey, uh, can we have you guys like really kind of bold and underline this section? And we're like, great, we'll make it bigger, we'll blow it out, we'll make it into like more of a sequence, like a, like a meaty scene. And they were like, uh, no, 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 can you guys just bold and underline it? <laughs> so we're like, uh, yeah, we have that technology. <laughs> And when it comes to intersectionality on screen, anybody can fix it. Whether you're a second AD, you're in casting, everybody can participate on screen and it can literally change overnight. We need that whole ecosystem to, uh, to support female directors and, and female writers. And we're not there yet. It's a Scottish Christmas zombie musical. You'll never see anything like it. That's, that's what film festivals are for. This year's Borses Award goes to a colony. Film festivals are great if you can sell a movie or get a little promo for your film, but what I think the long-term impact is are you building the community and are you building the business? And there's a lot of that at this festival and I really like it. What's your favorite thing about this festival? Oh, well, I love being in Whistler. 